Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to explain how to draw a qualitatively deflection shape of a beam. Qualitatively means that we don't have any number of load, we don't have any load, we don't have any length, we just have beam with the load and we just we need to draw a deflection shape of the beam. First of all we have beam with one spot fixed and other is overhang and we have point load also. How the qualitative deflection shape would be we would look like so we have fixed fixed part is gonna go straight a little bit then this is a curved part of the beam because the point load acting downward and then it will go up so slightly go up this is how the deflection shape would look like for this beam now we have second beam okay we have two roller spore in the middle of beam with the UDL load we don't know how much load is per meter or per length how the deflection shape would be so it's gonna go up it's gonna go down will make a little bit slope down as well it will go up and then down again Okay. The third beam we have both ends fixed and we have point load acting in the middle of the beam. How the deflection shape would look like? So we have fixed part, I mean fixed point, then we have point load acting downward, the effect due to point load, the beam will make curve and then will it will go up and then connect to the final point fourth type of beam we have fixed part I mean fixed port the other side we have roller and we also have a point load okay how the deflection shape would be it will go a little bit slightly straight will make a curve upwards will go down and it will end up on that point just because we have point load in making curve now we have this part of beam both spores are fixed we have two roller in the middle with the point load okay the deflection shape would be straight it will make curve upwards down again and then it will ends up here uh, I just need to make curve properly okay now we have this type of beam we have two spots in the middle of the beam one is roller one is each one and the two parts are overhanged this is overhanging beam from both sides we have point load acting in the middle of the spores okay so the deflection shape would be like this okay now we have a cantilever beam one end is fixed and at the other end we have a point load acting downwards so the deflection shape would be it will go slightly straight it will start to deflect and it will ends up like this so I just need to keep them a number number one number two three four five six and that is seven so it's a six that's it for today Thank you for watching YouTube video. Please don't forget to subscribe.